My favorite question to a small business owner is, tell me how you started your business. There is such passion in that. And I really love to hear the diverse stories that people have. And so I, I am a community person. I take on very uh, public community roles in my career. And so I'm anxious to get out there and uh, meet even more of our membership. After years working with the Oakville Chamber of Commerce, France Fournier has officially stepped into the role of Chamber President. I am uh, incredibly um, humbled and, and thankful uh, to be given the opportunity to work with the Oakville business community. I have, I feel I've come full circle. I started my career in Oakville uh, working in small business at uh, one of the big banks uh, and then worked with the nonprofit community, and now I'm back um, working with both the nonprofit and the business community. I'm thrilled. Her excitement at the appointment was shadowed with the loss as a longtime colleague moved on. Our former president and CEO, Drew Redden, and I had an incredibly close, collaborative working relationship. And I was, I, you know, as much as you're happy for somebody to move on to a great opportunity as he is, I was also sad to lose this relationship with him. And I was very honored that the board gave me the opportunity to present to them my views and my thoughts and my goals for the chamber for the coming years and giving me the opportunity to work with this incredible team we have. Having been executive vice president since 2016, she has already helped actualize advancements for the business community. We focused a lot of our efforts uh, to digitize our services to our members, uh, to really streamline that process, whether it be um, simple as uh, automatic invoicing, automatic payments. Uh, we've worked through to uh, provide, we've revamped our website. We have built a podcast room in our boardroom that will be hopefully available to our members in the next few months. So really uh, broadening our service scope and broadening the, um, the uh, offerings that we can do to the membership. Business is changing, uh, you know, and I don't think that as we are all so tired of Zoom, I think that there will always be that component of the online and in-person and how we integrate that. The pandemic has brought its own challenges. We're not able to do events as we have known, uh, been known to do. However, that has forced us to really focus on other areas. And so we've really stepped up our efforts in advocacy for the business community, which has been so important during the pandemic. Uh, we've really focused on our communication to our members. Uh, our members are telling us that the communications we put out to them are extremely important, especially at the start of the pandemic when information was coming out, uh, programs were coming out. So I want to continue that and also really continue to expand how we can help grow our business community. I feel strongly that we are only as successful as we are together as a community. And we are so lucky to live in such an incredible town like Oakville. And it's all different parts that click together as we work together that make this the community it is. Reporting for Halton News, I'm Nikki Wesley.